flower meditation. Make yourself comfortable with both feet on the floor and take a few deep breaths, breathing in and breathing out. Breathing in and breathing out. Breathing in and breathing out. And with each breath out, you release all the stress and all the tension from your body. And as you close your eyes, imagine yourself walking in the middle of the meadow on a warm day. The temperature is just right and you just like that warmth not too hot, it is just right. You feel the lovely breeze. It just rained earlier in the day and so it feels all fresh and you feel freshness that the rain brought in the air. And you decide to follow a path in the middle of the meadow. The grass is quite lush and you hear the wind moving the grass from side to side. And you think of a colour, a colour that is close to your heart, your favourite colour. And you are wondering if you can find some wild flowers that are in your favourite colour. So just take your time. And let yourself be guided to your favourite flower. And you are looking and have been looking for a while. And you still have not found a flower in your favourite colour. And you think to yourself, this must be my bad luck. I never seem to get what I want. But then... Another thought crosses your mind. What if this is an invite for me to go on an adventure looking for my flower? The flower of my favourite colour. If I always find everything straight away, then life is boring. Actually, I like the excitement of searching and looking and finding answers to my questions. So with that in mind, you set off on a walk to look for your favourite flower. You set the intention of finding that flower, flower of your favourite colour, and you follow your intuition of choosing a path that will lead you to your flower. And as you are on your path, you appreciate the lovely walk you have selected, one you have never taken before, and all these lovely views. And it is not long and you discover your flower, the flower of your favourite colour. You sit down next to it and have a look and thank it for guiding you to it. So you sit down next to it and express gratitude for being there for you, that you have found it after all. And as you are sitting next to it, you see the bees flying around and picking up the nectar from this lovely flower. And you thank the bee for working in harmony with nature, picking up the nectar from the flower, pollinating it. Without that bee, the flower would not be here. You start to become aware how we are all part of nature, all living in harmony, all helping each other. We all depend on each other and so you send loving thoughts to all plants out there and to all living creatures. 
You put your hands around your flower and you smell it. What a lovely smell. What a lovely fragrance this flower has. And the flower is inviting you to lie down and take a nice rest. And so you accept the offer of your flower and lie down right next to it. And the flower is at the top of your head. And you imagine that you invite the flower to come and visit you inside of yourself. So like any other visitor, you say, Welcome to my home. Welcome to my place. Please come in. And the flower is happy to go inside of you, gently stroking you at the top of your head. And it is starting to fill up your body. And as it does, it is soothing all your aches and pains and sending love to those aches and pains. You say, thank you, flower, for helping me heal from all my aches and pains. Thank you for filling me with love. Thank you for helping me to open up to love and for, for your healing power. I can now share your healing power with others. I can now tell others about you. I never knew you had such powers and healing abilities inside you. Thank you for teaching me about them. I now understand why the journey towards you took me a bit longer than I would have liked. And so I will leave you with your flower a bit longer and maybe it has got another message for you. And when you are ready, you can come back and open your eyes.